The first month of 2022 is in the books. Meteorologist Adam Rutt takes a look back. We're officially done with the month of January, so let's take a look back at the month that was. Compared to last year, January at least felt like the heart of winter across Kelloland at times. Though several spells of warmer weather came along, especially West River, we've had several blasts of Arctic air to help attempt to balance everything out. Whereas January 2021 had zero combined lows below zero among our four example cities, January 2022 saw 44 combined nights below zero, with Aberdeen doing this 16 times. As a result, each city was at least below average for overnight lows. Daytime highs were a different story. With a lack of snow across much of the region, highs soared well above average several times, allowing the monthly average temperature to hover a degree or two above or below average. I mentioned before about the lack of snow affecting temperatures. We truly were missing snow in portions of Kelloland. Pierre, for example, tied for the sixth lowest snow total on record at just 0.3 inches. Sioux Falls, Aberdeen, and Rapid City avoided the bottom 10 for that category, but they were also below average for the month. We're going to start the month of February on a cold and windy note, but then we warm up again as we head toward the first weekend. We'll see if the latter holds steady and sets the pace going further into the month. For Kelloland Weather, I'm meteorologist Adam Rudd.